At the highway that I am driving in. I want to drive by and to see this beautiful thing. <laughs> he was told, Your Majesty, we already have the design, everything has been planned. <laughs> then he said, Just redesign it. So uh, the Techno Park project has been re redesigned. And at the very front, at the very visible place, we will have our innovation center. And so the platform will be here where we are standing, and then the track, a uh, more narrow track, will go there three kilometers. We are planning to build four test tracks. Which will work under hot conditions for tropical countries. What we build in Belarus is for cold climate. So they told us, you have snow, you have winters, but we have the opposite, we have heat, we have sand. We may have sandstorms, we have salt in the air, we have salt in the soil, and this salt erodes everything. And railroads cannot be built because they get covered by sand. So you have to show us here that it's going to work. Then we will give you tens of projects. There are projects already and we have signed agreements for many of them, but I will not go into details here. So we started with one track, we will go and see, it's 400 meters. So it will be 100 meters, uh, 200 meters and 100 meters. So two uh, anchor supports and two uh, stations at the ends. We have already done the most complicated part, which you cannot see here. First of all, we uh, had uh, have made the project documentation, which is very complicated in very short term. We have also redesigned Unicar for tropical climates. We have manufactured it, and it has been tested in Belarus, including in thermal chamber with plus 60 degrees, but it kept 22 degrees within the Unica. Uh, now we will fly that Unicar here because the terms are very short. We will place it within the guest house. And so there will be the zero kilometer for Transnet. That will happen on the 29th of May. So the construction goes on. So don't pay attention to this chaos because basically it's a desert and everything has been dug up. But with time, of course, with landscaping, everything is going to be very beautiful. Here along the highway we are going to have three tracks, each two and a half kilometers long. Again, we are going to show all the types of our tracks, the hanging with long distances between the suppers, the, the supports, then the half rigid and the rigid one. 
And this length will uh, allow us to have a speed of 150 kilometers per hour. In Belarus, all many kilometers in length. In Belarus, all our tracks uh, are uh, shorter than one kilometer. And the maximum speed of the safety that we can achieve is 90 kilometers per hour. Therefore, the maximum safe speed would be 90 kilometers. We even modeled unibikes and unibuses to get to the speed of 100 kilometers per hour. But unibikes and unibuses, we were even able to speed up there till 100 or uh, kilometers per hour. But uh, the, the city cars and the cargo cars are uh, now designed for 150 kilometers per hour. So we are going to show here all the types of our rolling stock, both uh, for city transportation and for cargo. Including for transporting large car, uh, cargo amounts and uh, large numbers of passengers. So the tracks will be designed for the load of 50 tons. So we could transport sea containers that weigh 35 tons. And they could take trains with 300 passengers. Это здесь очень интересно, именно вот это направление, а мы это в Беларуси показать не будем. So that's where we can show it, because we can't show it in Belarus. Там легкие путевые. Because we have light tracks there. До 10 тонн. Up to 10 tons. Это одна вот наша научная база. So, После мы планируем здесь даже создать институт скайвей. So the, this will be one scientific base for us, and we are also planning to create Skyway Institute here. Ну, в структуре университета американского шаржа. Within the structure of Sharjah American University. Где мы можем обучать студентов, проектировать струнные дороги, строить и строить. So there we will teach students to design, to build and to service the string transportation. Но это только часть Skyway. But that is only one part of Skyway. У нас еще высокоскоростное направление и гиперскоростное. We also have the high speed and hyper speed directions. Здесь трассы очень короткие. Here the tracks are very short. Для того, чтобы получить 500 км в час, длина трассы должна быть минимум 25 км. In order to get 500 km per hour, the track should be at least 25 km long. Из них 10 км надо разгоняться, 10 тормозить и 5 ехать. So it would be 10 км for acceleration, 10 км for riding and 5 км for breaking down. Поэтому нам отведен участок земли в Абу-Даби. Therefore we have a piece of land in Abu Dhabi. Протяженностью 60 километров. Which is 60 километров long. Где будем мы в том числе гиперскоростные трассы делать. Where we are going to also build hyperspeed tracks. В фурватной трубе, где скорость будет до 1250 километров в час. In the pipe that will be, the speed will be up to 1250, that is 1250 kilometers per hour. Минимум 30 километров разгоняться, 30 километров тормозить. Because uh, they need at least 30 kilometers to accelerate and 30 kilometers to slow down. And as the largest emirate is Abu Dhabi, therefore we got that piece of land right there. И параллельно, естественно, мы выходим на рынок, потому что все видят, что мы серьезные люди, мы строим, а мы просто говорим. In parallel, this helps us win the market because the people see that we are serious. We are not just talking; we are building. So the trust towards our company is growing. And we will soon start the target project. До окончания строительства. Even before we finish the construction here. В этом наша стратегия. That's our strategy. And now let's walk through. Let's see. Well, we will have to walk uh, on the sand in the desert. So let's get in there.